Well, hi guys. It's Sunday. Uh, day after I just crossed the road. I noticed a few things yesterday. That bolt getting loose. So I tightened it up. And being this was being an awful pain in the butt yesterday, plugging up, I put a chain on it. And there's plenty of room. It can move. It shouldn't cause a problem. It's latched in to the disc frame here. And got a bolt through it. So that shouldn't cause a problem. It shouldn't move. It should stay right there. And hopefully won't have those awful plugging up moments again. Uh, I hate to run this like that. But don't really have a lot of choice. I need to get this last pass put on that. Uh, the bearing's not hurt. Flange is shot. So, oh, what's six bucks for a couple of new flanges at this point? But it just blows my mind. What moved? What happened here? Is the bearing there is good, but yet it pulled it out of the flange this way, and that can't move. So I really don't know what happened, but uh, it's windy right now. It's going to be dusty as all get out, so I don't believe I am going to uh, do much filming. Kind of a odd one. The low clouds are coming this way to the north. The other clouds are heading east. So you got a crosswind going on. Uh, very strange. But it is what it is. I've got work to do, so it just this is kind of showing the instability in the atmosphere. You got clouds up top going north, got low clouds going north, and the clouds in between heading east. So they're calling for rain tonight, and I believe we're going to get it. <laughs> oh, eh, oh well. But uh, when I get done disking, I'll show you what it looks like and yada, yada, yada. So hang on, guys. We'll be back after a bit, and you'll see what things look like. So hang on. Well, hi, guys. You're looking at that mess over by the house. Uh, this is three times over it with a disc. It's not broke up bad. Uh, a lot of green there that's got to die and dry up. They're forecasting rain tomorrow, Monday, Tuesday, and then the part of Wednesday. So hopefully this will work out good. Um, I hit this, give this another pass today. Uh, it's a lot better, not perfect by any stretch of the imagination, but you get rain on it, and this will be in pretty good shape, really. Uh, kind of the reason I didn't want to mold board plow this is knowing this soil how it gets when it gets wet. Um, you break it deep and it gets wet well it just there's no bottom to it so if I disc it uh, four or five inches deep if it gets muddy then that's how deep you're going to go you know basically uh, that's theoretically of course but 
Uh, this didn't break up bad at all. Better than I expected it to, I'll put it that way. Not perfect, but there's a lot of green material there that's got to dry up and die. A lot. And a lot of grass that rolled up, you know, where it was cut. But all in all, pretty good. Pretty good. Thought about giving it a pass completely this way and almost did it. And I thought, no, nah, it's not. There's too much green in this center. Uh, it just make a ball up like a mess like that. But gets the rain on it. Uh, the stuff will start shriveling up. And it'll look like the front up there. And then I can do, you know, another good pass or two on it and it's harrogate it and it's good to go for winter. Ha! Ah, among other things I've got to do. <laughs> so, I call this a, a success. Like I say, it's not perfect by any stretch of the imagination. But for this ground to be breaking up in August in, toward the end of August uh, it's breaking up pretty good really good actually normally it doesn't do that <laughs> uh, yeah so I'm gonna call it a day guys I gotta go home and mow my grass before it rains well I gotta mow my grass tonight it's gonna rain tomorrow uh, so I might sleep in tomorrow. Enjoy the thunder storms. <laughs> so we'll see you next time, guys. And as always, please comment, rate, and subscribe. Uh, may not have been the best idea to do thing to do with a disc, but it's better than plowing it. Because I know what will happen if I plow it. And I don't want to deal with that. So we'll see you next time, guys. And as always, please comment, rate, and subscribe. See you next time, guys.